Hi everyone, my name is Julie Sebi. I write the Analytics Corner blog that focuses on data engineering, analytics, and visualization with Alteryx and Spotfire. You can find my site at the URL shown on the screen. Please click the subscribe button in YouTube to subscribe to my channel and be notified of any future video updates. I recently wrote a post on tips and habits for efficiency in Alteryx workflows. And one of those tips showcased some new Alteryx search functionality. And I got a lot of comments from people that said they didn't know about this new functionality. And then today I discovered another piece of this functionality that I thought was worth sharing. And what I'm going to show you today is something that was uh, present on the screen in the application for the entire time that I've used this version of Alteryx and I just never noticed it. And I thought surely other people have maybe overlooked this really useful function as well. So I'm going to start by pulling up the find pane. And this is what I covered in my previous post. So you can do control F and that will pull up the find pane. And this allows you to search within the application, search amongst the IDs, names, column names, annotation, and any configuration of tools within the application. I use this in particular with annotations. So I know that I'm going to search annotations in particular. And so I will write annotations with that in mind and then search my known keywords to help me navigate in large workflows. And this is super, super helpful. But what I hadn't noticed until fairly recently was that there is also a search pane within or a search function within the results pane. And so here you can see I have some data on rigs and pads for different reports. Maybe I've made some changes to tools and I want to see if the updates are correct for a particular pad. Here I only have 45 records, but what about those cases where you have hundreds or even thousands of records in the results pane? The only way to check specific records is to use filter tools, sort tools, and basically add tools onto your canvas. And so that's where this is really helpful. So let's say that I want to find the results for Tomcat. Just type that in there. I don't even have to specify the column that I'm searching. It's going to search all of the data. And that will pull up all the data for the Tomcat Ursula pad. And I can't tell you how much time this saves me. So now I don't have to deal with extra tools. I don't have to go back and remove those tools later. This is super simple and yet so incredibly helpful. The only caveat that I'll give you is that a lot of times you can have partial, res partial results shown in your results pane. Like let's say you have a million records total, it's only going to show you about 2,000. If what you're searching for is not in the results pane, you won't get any results. So in that case, you would still have to use tools, but for slightly smaller data sets, this is really helpful. So that's it for this week. Uh, I hope you found this useful. Please hit that little subscribe button in YouTube. I would really appreciate it. And uh, feel free to leave uh, comments in the comments section. Thanks.